Okay. Right. Ready? Now this is Whitley Villas and we are in District 11. Today Property Lim Brothers is heading up to a freehold landed cluster home that resides over 3,000 square feet. What's mm. your meal script? So free flow. Okay, let's go. Five bedrooms, five baths and a direct access into your own personal swimming pool. So if you're in the market looking for a cluster home that is priced at around the 4 odd million dollar mark or is looking to rent a cluster home for about $12,000 a month, I think that you are in for a trip today. Let's go! Alright, so coming in here, this is of course your private garage. We've got 10 units right here and our unit is right at the most inner corner of this development. So this is the unit, but I will show you this later on. Let's head upstairs first. Alright, so this is Whitley Villas completed in 2012. This is a freehold development and of course right behind me, we've got these 10 very exclusive units. Our unit is on the left right here, which is the innermost unit, very far away from the main road right outside. This is developed by Fortune Properties, which also has got other notable landed cluster homes such as S3 Villas, Ventura Heights as well as Shamrock Villas. And as you can see that the developer's intention is quite clear here whereby they really want to infuse the very close knitted kind of relationships among the neighbours within this gated community right here. Pulling up the site map, we've got four pairs of semi-Ds and two detached units within this strata landed development. Our unit is located deepest in which means the most privacy and least noise exposure. And our unit is actually located right at the end with a side frontage right here which I must show you. This is a semi-D. So of course we get this side frontage right here. That's when you can get a lot more light and ventilation into the house internally as well. A direct access right into your own private pool right here. And what I really like about this corner unit is that we are not only the furthest distance away from the main road right there, which means that a lot of privacy as well as the most quiet environment for you. This space right here is also great for you to do your barbecue sessions and also more sitting space for you for your gatherings as well. Alright, so let's head on inside. So on top of Having this level 1, we have got two other levels on top of us as well as a basement level right below. At the basement level, we have got your private garage with two parking lots, a nice size entrance foyer, a bedroom with an ensuite bath. There's also an open yard space, a helper's room as well as a home shelter. On level 1, a large living room, dining room, a powder room, your dry and wet kitchen, a backyard as well as the side private enclosed space which I will show you more later. Moving on to level 2, there are 3 bedrooms and 2 baths and finally on the attic level there is where you can find your master bedroom, ensuite bath, a walk-in wardrobe as well as an attic storeroom. So all the spaces are great and functional right here, great for your big family or a multi-generation kind of living at the 4 odd million quantum mark. And at this point of filming, we are also listing this unit up for rent at $12,000 a month. So if perhaps you're looking for some sort of a transitional home or an interim home or your next new home is being rebuilt and you need the one to two years timeline for you to transit over to the new home, this could be also a potential option for you. So moving on to this personal enclosed space right here which is at the side of the house. Fitted in an outdoor set, a retractable awning has also been done to provide shade as well as shelter. So if I'm to own the home, this is potentially what I will do for the space right here. I will lay it over with timber decking and throw in a comfortable outdoor lounging set. Bring up a mini bar counter set up against this corner for your wind down nights. I can also throw in a nice old school type of swing right by the corner or put up some fencing if I've got children or pets. Coming to this space over here, this is the living room. If you want to check out how wide this space is, do come down for a physical viewing and I'm happy to share more with you. We've got a three-seater couch that has been fitted in right here. Currently, the owner has fitted in a short throw projector, so this is very nice as well. We've got plenty of storage space that is flush along this entire TV console. And I will pull this open just to show you that, okay, we've got this full stretch of balcony doors, which once you open it up, you can actually allow a lot of natural light to come in. You can open this entire stretch of doors. This is a big area for you to hold your friends. And hopping on over to this corner right here, this is the dedicated dining space. We have fitted in a round table together with a four-seater setup. So over here, easily I think we can do up to a six or eight-seater in fact. And this leads on to the dry kitchen. Very 
very tastefully done as well so of course you can have your wine glasses over here and your stash of alcohol right on top lots of storage spaces all comes with soft closure a wine chiller as well and also an inbuilt Bosch oven this is also where the powder room is at all cladded in white marble so very nice and very convenient for your guests as well behind me this is where the kitchen is at a very squarish kind of setup right here three burner hop as hood done top and bottom cabinetry is all done as well and a dual sink that has been installed right here and of course this door leads out to the back yeah all right so before we head up let's bring up the map to talk about this location itself and why this location is so special so behind us is the chancery hill area which is largely a two-story mixed landed area We've also got Montclair at Whitley and the Whitley residences towards the back together with all the Chancery cluster landed right behind. So now if you're hunting for a 99 year type of leasehold for a cluster landed right in this specific area, there are a couple of units that are going for about 3.5 odd million dollars. And if you're going for the freehold specific kind of cluster landed right here, those are going for about 4 million all the way to 5 odd million. Of course, then the key difference comes down to the difference in terms of the size itself. We'll talk more about that later in the pricing analysis. So where are we exactly? The road fronting Whitley Villas is Whitley Road and there is this ultra convenience when you can either head left into PIE towards Tuas in just a minute which of course will bring you towards the Bukit Timah area. Turning right will lead you to Thompson Road which also leads to PIE heading towards Changi Airport. From there you can access CTE which will bring you to the rest of the island very quickly. Right across that is the Mount Pleasant MRT which has been built but it's not running yet. We'll talk more about that later. So back to Thompson Road that will bring us to the Balestier area for lots of famous food options as well as more such as Shaw Plaza and Zhongshan Mall. Further down, we will hit Novena Hub where you can find Novena Square and Velocity for all your amenities and shopping needs. Novena MRT is also right there and it's a 4 minutes drive away from here. Right there, we also get our Novena Medical Hub where lots of medical professionals and specialists work at. For parents, you will be glad to know that we are within 1km to ACS Primary as well as CHIJ Toapayo Primary. We are also in close proximity to other schools such as ACS Junior, King Chain School, SCGS, Marymount Convent School and SGI Junior. Now let's head upstairs to check out the rest of the home. Alright, so coming up to this second level, we've got three bedrooms and two baths that are located on this level itself. Parquet flooring runs across the entire floor. So coming in here, this is the junior master. We have got a single bed that is located right at this corner over here for your size reference. Of course, easily you can fit in a queen size bed as well. And this is the corner where you can put in your study desk. In terms of facing, this is also facing towards the front of the house, which is towards the pool itself. We have got a dedicated walk-in wardrobe space right here. So this is very convenient as you're heading into your ensuite bath. WC, an enclosed shower area which is nice. Some racks for you to put out your toilet trees. And a window which is great for ventilation. And heading out to the staircase landing, this is where you get your common bath right here. Similar in theme as well, we've got the enclosed shower area, WC. An open window which is great and a basin together with under storage cabinets. Heading on to this common bedroom, a single size bed has also been fitted in here with a side table. We've got a movable wardrobe space right there, built-in fan as well as the aircon. So this is actually facing towards the back of the house, a very quiet area as well. And hopping on to the next side where we have got the other common bedroom, this is basically similar in terms of size. Fitted in with a movable wardrobe, there is a baby's bed as well and also a lounging chair right here at this corner. So in terms of space, a blank slate for you to create your own bedroom right here. So as mentioned earlier, there are different types of developments within this Whitley area that is catering to different groups of buyers depending on their quantum and budget. So over here in this Whitley address, what that translates to you would be accessibility and convenience. By the side, Montclair at Whitley, a small freehold development with 10 units similar to us is asking for 4.6 million to 4.8 million for the 4,200 square feet unit. At Whitley Residences, also a freehold strata landed project. The unit size at 5,000 over square feet are asking between 4.96 million to 5.3 million. Lastly, at Chancery Hill Villas, freehold in status, a corner unit size at 7,400 square feet is asking at 5.795 million. 
For the 99-year cluster house at the Chancery Residences, size around 3,200 to 3,300 square feet, those are already asking for 3.5 to 3.6 million. And the larger units within this area right here, those are commanding towards the higher end of the 5 plus million. And even though our unit here is smaller, it's equipped with 5 bedrooms and 5 baths. It's commanding towards the lower end and it's asking at 4.2 million negotiable. And with that, let's head up to the top floor and check it out. Alright, so heading in here, this is the private master bedroom space which is away from all the other bedrooms. And right behind me, this is a nice dresser area. We've got a king size bed that has been set up right here with one side table. And as you can notice that this unit has been renovated slightly with this uh, light beige kind of tone setup. So right over at this other side here, we've got your own private space. We've got a couch that has been fitted in right here. And so one possible idea is that we can do up like a work from home kind of workstation right at this corner. If you want to have more wardrobe space on top of your dedicated walk-in wardrobe space that is beside your ensuite bath, you can easily is flush this entire corner here with your wardrobe space otherwise this can be a very nice lounging corner for you and your partner you can set up a tv right at the corner over there and throw in some very nice comfortable bean bags or sofa right at this corner as well and over at this corner we also have got this small little nook here which you can probably put in some of your other bulky items otherwise we've got this built-in storage already done up for you as well and heading right across this will be your walk-in wardrobe plenty of wardrobe for your clothes as well as your ties and cufflinks and your watches and connecting this will be your ensuite bath fully cladded with marble and you have got this enclosed WC right here racks for your toiletries windows four panels in fact which is great storage right underneath basin on top an enclosed rain shower and behind me this is a bathtub which is great for you to soak in at the end of a hard day's work all right and with that let's head downstairs to the basement to check that out and also chat about the upcoming developments within this area itself let's go Alright, so before I show you the rest of this basement zone, let's talk about what's upcoming in this entire area. Firstly, Mount Pleasant Residential Plans, HDB has announced development plans for a new housing estate in the Mount Pleasant area where the former police academy is currently sitting on. So when fully developed, the new 33 hectare estate will provide about 5,000 new homes. It is slated that the first VTO project in this new estate will be launched in the next four years. And thus, this brings me to the next news which is the Mount Pleasant MRT station. Now this MRT, which is an underground station, has already been constructed. Basically, the government has announced that this MRT station will open when the housing developments around this site are ready. So with the new HDB estate that is coming up within this area, this will rejuvenate the entire real estate market within this area itself and also provide a fresh pool of buyers 10 to 15 years down the road for you. And secondly, when you get an MRT station that starts operating right across the road from where you are staying, that is going to be providing an instant value jump to your property since that is going to be providing the accessibility and the convenience for the residents that will be living within this area right here. Alright, so coming to this basement area, this door actually leads out to the basement car park. Two parking lots for your cars. We've got a corner right there, shoe racks have been done up. Uh, also a great space for your bicycles as well. And heading back in here, this is where you're going to get your bomb shelter as well as your helper's room. So bomb shelter towards the left, so more storage space for you. And also a helper's room towards the right. And heading right out here, this feature wall actually conceals the door that's leading out to the backyard. So this has been done up as a laundry area. This is a great spot for you and also very accessible to where your helpers are staying at. On the flip side, right here, there is also a bathroom for your helpers as well, so very convenient. And I think the main highlight for this basement will then be this bedroom right here with its connecting bath. So very flexible space right here whereby you can do it like a family entertainment kind of room. Alternatively, you can actually do this up like a granny's room. A sliding door has also been done up so you can easily enclose this space up for privacy. And lastly, a very nice size ensuite bath right here. Team-wise, the mosaic tiles are similar to the bathrooms upstairs as well. Alright, so we have come to the end of this home tour. If you are in the market looking for a cluster landed home in this Whitley area for about 4 plus odd million, our contact details are right below. If you have enjoyed our content so far, do hit the like and subscribe button on our YouTube channel. We are also on Facebook, Instagram as well as TikTok. My name is John Lin, Property Lin Brothers. Always happy to show you the place. 
this development is uh, completed by <laughs> and oops. <laughs> Okay, this is not Oh, Sorry, sorry. One more. 